So this is a Dirt Devil branded SD12000 manufactured by Royal Appliance in Glenwill, Ohio. Well, it's it's that's just the company. It's manufactured in China, of course. So there's obviously going to be problems this with anything made in China. Um, people complain about two things. The belt comes off and the filter doesn't work. In other words, fine dust comes out these ports on the side. So to correct the fine dust problem, take your filter out, get a 132nd thick. Um, this is 132nd, but get a 132nd thick O-ring because this gap between the tooth and the lip is too big or alternatively these teeth are too small this isn't recessed enough and so the filter if you put it in and you turn it and lock it you'll notice it shakes now if you push it down and turn it and lock it it seems to be tight but as soon as you give it a good tug it's going to pop loose or this you know the vacuum increases maybe if it gets some dust on it so it's it, it doesn't it doesn't work there's a there's an engineering production QC air all three and so you got one thirty second nitro O ring and you can just push it around the outside edge you can get that at probably Napa would help you as far as um, because the ceiling surface here is around the outside edge here so you need you need to uh, you you can't like you know do anything else this is where it seals this this outside the filter so add that O ring and you should be able to you know, push it and turn it and lock it in place. I've chosen, because I don't have that O-ring easily available, I've chosen to get this filter tan fiber sheet 3046. Maybe I'll have some of this lying around. And you can cut a square out, use a compass to draw inner outer circle, use a exacto blade to cut it, and put it in around the filter here on this surface where my fingernail is pointing. You can see that. And if, if you can't get it around the last little tooth and just you know use some spray tack and break it and, and tack it down because the filter is washable and this material is is washable too it's uh, resistant against oil coolant and gasoline so it should be fine um, as far as the belt falling falling off that's a, another production error qc error as well uh, the belt can only be installed one way so they must have had a rash of these produced with the belt on backwards and so people would get them out of the box and start them up and immediately the belt would fall off. Well, the belt's on backwards. That's that problem. So that's how you solve those two problems with this vacuum cleaner.